frequent flyer points and even cash, they're just some of the incentives to get you to switch health insurance funds. But experts are urging people to check the policy first to ensure you have the right cover. Father of two, Daniel Kotsianis, made the switch to a new health fund. In doing so, it saved him $40 a fortnight and now has much better coverage. I found the most surprising thing was the value for money I'm now getting compared to what I was getting before. March is a month of incentives. Health funds offering frequent flyer points, free weeks and cash to entice people to switch. Deals include Qantas Health up to 120,000 points on sign-up, Bupa up to eight weeks free on eligible policies, while AIA is offering $900 cash back over three years for those who take out a combined hospitals and extra policy. It's really important that the policy is actually suited to you or your family's needs. Although there are those deals and incentives on offer, you really need to shop around and look at what, what is valuable to you to find suitable cover. Premiums are expected to rise by an average of 2.7% this year, which could add an average of $125 to a family's policy and $58 to a single's policy. A survey by comparison group Isolate found 39% of people who switched policies in the past two years said they saved at least $100 off their annual premium, while 18% said they saved at least $300 a year. Having kids that are young, growing up, there's always things to do, especially dental, uh, Cairo, those things are now covered. Um, and if I wasn't covered, I'd be in trouble. Vicky Jardim, Nine News. For breaking news, turn to Peter Overton, nightly at six.